Many people are concerned about ransomware hijacking the data on their computer. There are many ways to protect yourself. If you're running Windows 10, one of these ways many people are still not aware of is to enable controlled folder access, which is a security feature built into Windows Defender designed to protect your files and folders from ransomware. In this video, I will show you the basic steps needed to enable it on your PC. Coming up on Tech Gumbo. The first step is to open your Settings app on Windows 10. You can get to it by going to your Start menu and selecting the Settings icon. Or you can simply do a search in the Cortana bar and select it. At the bottom of this window, select Update and Security. On the left side, select the Windows Defender tab. Then here at the top, click on Open Windows Defender Security Center. In the Security Center, in the top row, on the left, select Virus and Threat Protection. Near the bottom of this window, click on Virus and Threat Protection Settings. Now you need to scroll down and find Controlled Folder Access. Toggle the slider to turn it on. Doing this, will generate a list of folders that will be protected from unauthorized access by malicious programs like ransomware. The only apps or programs that can gain access to these folders are ones that are confirmed to be safe. To see the entire list of folders that have controlled access, select Protected Folders. These are the default folders which you can't remove. If you want to add another folder to be protected, select the plus to the left of Add a Protected Folder. Then just navigate to the folder that you want to add. Let's go back to the previous screen, then scroll down to the Controlled Folder Access Area. There may be times when Defender blocks a program or app that you trust. To allow access to that program, select Allow an App through Controlled Folder Access. Then click on the plus to the left of Add an Allowed App. Then navigate to the program's location and select it, and then click on Open to allow it access to the protected folders. Then it will show up in your list of approved apps, and then you won't see any warnings about that program anymore. Thanks for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if it helped you out. Remember that keeping your operating system and drivers up to date and backing up your data on a regular basis can help you from being a victim of ransomware. If you're new to this channel, subscribe and click on the bell notification icon for more security tips and other tech-related stuff from Tech Gumbo.